guys, it is time for another 17 first listen. Hello, 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 this is Ashley and you guys are watching Ashley D Reactions and today I'm going to be checking out some 17. They just dropped their latest, their fourth mini album, AL1. And I am ready for this because I love 17. I cannot wait to go see 17. I, nothing has been released yet, which I'm glad about because I need, I need some time. So the, the fact that it hasn't been announced yet, I'm okay with that for now. But I plan to go to the Dallas stop. But let's get into this mini album. It is six tracks long. It's only about 20 minutes. And I'm really excited. Um, from what I remember, so like there's like... The main track and I think there's one other track and then like a bunch of them are like broken down like into not their usual like group subunits. I think some of them are but some of them are like not because there's I know that there's Jun and Ming Hao. They have a song so yeah I'm, I'm excited. Let's just go ahead and jump into this. We're going to start with the title track which is Don't Wanna Cry and it's a great song but I haven't listened to it without the MV yet so it's going to be the first time that I do that. I'm so ready. Get that, that snap in there. The song is just, uh, it's not slow, but it has this angelic, like, light feel to it. It's hard to describe, but I love it. It is so different, because, like, I was listening to some 17 while I was coming home from work today. So different from like the other tracks that they've done. It really is different, like they said, and I like it. Yes, this, it's it's just there's just something nice about it. There's just something nice about it. Oh, that is very generic. Although, like he, they sound great, but it, it's one of those things that you hear a lot. That oh, you know what I'm talking about. Okay, so this next track up is Habit, and this, I did just check, it is the Vocal Unit team song, so it's all Vocal Unit, y'all. Okay, but yeah, let's check this out. What's Habit got to offer? Okay. It has a very kind of like, Western kind of sound to this one. Like, it almost reminds me of like, a James like, um, James Morrison song. Ow. They have such a lovely vocal unit. Yes. It's pretty. It is pretty. That's what I'm getting from the vibe from this album so far. That is pretty. Harmonies and the vocalizations in this song are absolutely lovely. They're they're just lovely. Ooh. The way that their voices just kind of melt together, so pretty. Ah! <laughs> yes. Okay. So the next song is "If I," which is a hip hop scene. Let's see what the. Let's see what. Simple beat, but I like it. A little bit different. Okay, they got some funky things going on with the instrumentation and the and like the lyrics. They're playing with things here, and I like it. It's different. It's almost like the um, lyrics are toying with the actual like music as much as the music is influencing the lyrics. Like, you know what I mean? Hey! If I is one of those song I, songs I feel like I'm gonna be banging with. Like, it's just something about it. I like the hip hop unit. I'm soft for the hip hop unit. Like, I think I have more biased members in the vocal unit, but I'm so soft for the hip hop unit. I just, oh. Uh, I'm, I'm just soft for them. <laughs> okay, so next up we have Swimming Fool, which should be fun. This is the performance unit, so. Okay. 
really upbeat. It's got a little bit of a shiny feel. It's a little bit funky. Real fun. This is so, this is really funky. It's so funky. Give me that funk. Okay, that was funky. Okay, so this next song is My Eye. And this is the one with Jun and Ming Hao. So China Line, let's do this. Okay, Jun! Jun and Ming Hao, get your shine! Okay, boys. I, got, I, like, the, I like the beat to it. It definitely has a little bit of like um, top house feel to it, but it's like slower than what you would expect for that. But it's definitely, yeah. Okay, okay. I'm, I'm like being out. Okay. I can get down. I can get down. It just kind of stopped though. Okay, so now we have the next, the final track that's on the digital only. Um, this is Crazy in Love, This is Everybody. <laughs> this song is so different. Get it, get it. Yes. I am down with that album. It is different. It is different from 17 albums in the past. It is definitely different, for sure. Um, so I think, mm -hmm, I think Don't Wanna Cry or My Eye are my favorite. Ooh, but I really liked Habit too. Those are like my top three. Don't Wanna Cry, Habit, and My Eye are my three favorites off of this album, actually. But I really did like If I Too. I didn't love Swimming Fool, which makes me sad because I previously, I adored Highlight, so I was really hype. And it's really funky, but for some reason it just didn't quite hit it as much as I wanted it to. I think probably because I had such high expectations after Highlight. But I do quite like this album. It is, like I said, very different from their previous albums. They do have two other tracks, so they also have Who, which is only on the CD, which I do plan to get very shortly, so I guess I'll do a reaction once I get that, and it'll just be for just that one song. Um, and then they also have the remastered version of Check In, which I've done uh, a um, reaction to the Check In MV that they did way, way months back, months and months back, um, but yeah. I really like Check In. Check In is a funky song. But yeah, I love, love, love Seventeen. I really can't wait to go see them. But uh, yeah, let me know which song is your favorite off of the album in the comments down below and I'll see you guys next time. I'm out. Goodbye,